Keep the first aid kit around. done. Let me get my hair fixed here. Does it look cool? No, I'm just playing. Um, finally got the quail pin done. Thank y'all for joining me along the ride. Um, it's really hot. Stay hydrated. I don't know where all of you live. I don't know how the weather is there. But here, it's hot. I don't know what the temperature is. I don't need to know. I just need to know. It's hot. So I'm really happy to get this quail pen done. Uh, I've been needing to do it for a while. Um, and uh, I thought while I would do it, I would just, you know, kind of turn on the camera and let you see, see how I go about it. 
Um, I was looking for, you know, some scrap wood because I have a lot of scrap wood laying outside. But um, I, I ran across this dresser and I was like, hey, you know, it just kind of clicked. Like, that would, that would make a good pen. I just, you know, tear some parts out of it, reuse them, which you saw I did. I, I reused uh, pieces for the, for the door and, and the door frame. Uh, those, those brace, those little brace pieces that were in there, I reused those for that. And um, I had these shingles laying out there. I was like, hey, perfect roof. Um, good thing is, too, down here the ground's not level, so this pen is actually tilted forward a little bit. Uh, so the water can run run off the top of the chicken coop and down onto the pen and then off the front. I left it overhanging a bit so, you know, it wouldn't run down, down in there on the quail. Um, but... I'm happy with it. I'm really happy with it. Uh, is it not? Is it perfect? No, of course not. Uh, could it be built better? Of course. But um, it doesn't have to be perfect. Um, it just has to work. Um, in the words of Paul Mack over at Farmhands Companion, uh, it doesn't have to be perfect. It just has to be. And I like that. And I want to give him credit um, for my, my idea to do these homestead building videos because I'm doing them sort of in his in his style uh not because i want to uh, copy him but i think it's a good uh you know just it's enjoyable to watch uh you know like like farmhands companion and uh the my self-reliance channel um i like watching those channels and, and i thought maybe people would enjoy seeing the process that i go through doing things around my house around our homestead and uh, hopefully it can give you gives you some ideas on on things that you could do and that's what I want to do is show you that I'm actually doing things. I'm not just uh, saying you should do things. I'm actually uh, practicing what I preach. So I hope you enjoyed this first episode this, of this um, homestead building series. And uh, it's just going to go, it's just going to get better from here. So uh, I got sweat in my eye. I got to get back to work after I cool down here for a minute. Stay self-reliant.